a tremendous way to close the curtain on the 2016 regular season at Stone Stadium for South Carolina with the 2-1 win over the 12th ranked Wildcats of Kentucky. Hello everybody, I am Birch Entley along with Brian Hand as we recap this very pivotal match, crucial match in CUSA play as far as the standings go. The Gamecocks and the Wildcats could be anywhere between fourth and second. Gamecocks most likely will finish in second place with this win, but a huge way for the Gamecocks to go out in front of this crowd at Stone Stadium. Yeah, and even probably more important than that is a huge RPI win for South Carolina as they try to get an at-large NCAA tournament berth. Obviously, they want to win the Conference USA tournament coming up next week, but it's just a huge win overall for the Gamecocks. Well, let's take a look at the highlights. We will start in the first period with the Gamecocks getting on the board first as Burnett tosses it in, Ellingstad, and then it is Gunjansson right there in the right place at the right time, sneaking it past Stuart Ford, his seventh goal of the season for the sophomore from Iceland. Then, second half after the break, just four minutes in, Andre Street called for the handball, and there is the penalty kick for Jordan Wilson. Equal at that point, then with five minutes left, just under five minutes left, Andre Streets, what does he get there? Validation. Yeah, beautifully done. Great ball sent in by Deacon. Beautifully hit in with some tenacity by Street. A well-deserved 2-1 to -one win for the South Carolina Gamecocks. First time the Gamecocks have beaten Kentucky at Stone Stadium since 2007 as they win 2-1. to -one. For Brian Hand, I am Birch Antley.